beautiful scene. This is the first time we've ever seen these tiny little cubs, all three of them together, over there in the front. This is the first time we've seen them with the rest of the pride. It's not to say that it is the first. Look at them already playing with their older cousins who've been kept at bay while these little cubs were too fragile and frail to be able to play with them, but now they're big enough and they certainly can learn a lot from their older cousins. I guess it's like having an older brother and sister. You get taught the ways of the world a bit quicker and these guys certainly are going to be brought up very tough because you can see already that older male there is wanting to play possibly a little bit too roughly with that tiny cub but they've got sharp teeth so they can fend for themselves if need be and as you can see they're all just having the greatest time not a worry in the world So there's also a few other vehicles enjoying the sighting with us. You may hear the guests on the vehicles chatting with excitement. And what a magical scene this is. This is actually exactly where we left them this morning. We were on the opposite bank, kind of where that big tree is that you can see. And now we've come onto the... Lisa, I couldn't agree more that this is the sweetest little sighting and I think it's only going to get better as long as these guys stay. So those are the slightly older cubs. That one that's just walked out of frame is the generation slightly older than the smallest cubs. So just to fill everyone in, especially if it's your first time joining us, there's four sets of cubs here amounting to 13 cubs in total, three of which are the tiniest. There's another three that are slightly bigger and then there's seven of the bigger ones from two separate litters and the first time we've seen all 13 of them together is now we haven't seen all 13 out in the open just yet but there are that many of them and they've got four mothers who are fast asleep nearby passed out and I guess understandably so a huge task to raise these cubs, find them food, nurse them, look after them. But they're doing a great job thus far. And despite the huge risks that these young cubs face from other lions, hyenas, leopards, buffalo, a host of animals will definitely have a go of these cubs if they get half a chance. And despite this, these four mothers have been doing an incredible job raising them and have not lost one since we have been here. Although one was left in a crevice for at least 24 hours that we know of. We're not sure, we're not sure what that mother was thinking, but besides that, <laughs> they've done a great job. Well, the action does simply not want to stop coming in this afternoon, so we're gonna rush you off to Tristan with another large herd of elephants.